us as we live intentionally here in Chiang Mai Park. Help God as we are so thankful. Our favorite thing about the market is being able to buy fresh fruits and vegetables. It's just about um, seven or ten minutes away, and we can go there and come back with quite a few things to eat during the week. We cook a lot of our meals at home. This is us on the bike um, at the light um, with our stuff from the market. Enjoy a good smoothie in the morning, many mornings. Here, Jack is helping me out make a dessert out of coconuts. With the pudding was to share with friends while I ate poetry. Jimmy's he's a great cook, I get to help out sometimes and I'm learning quite a bit. We got to help cook whole pig Filipino style. We have a great community to be part of. This is khao soy. It's a northern Thai dish that we really enjoy. Thank you for your generosity. We also enjoy sesame oils for this year. Well, finally get to go for a run. It's been over two months since the air quality's been good enough. So now, had a big storm last night, which also knocked the motorbike over at a restaurant. So it's broken down, so I'm gonna run to the gas station and I get it figured out. So uh, that's an awesome day for me. Praising the Lord for rain and a run. But uh, yeah, let's see if this bike will start back up again. Be there, eat Paphroditus. So thankful for all the work that we get to do together. Um, here I am at school um, doing our afternoon break. We've got kids in the playground, we hear the voices, and we're so blessed to have, to have a much prettier air today as we have some, some wind blowing through and giving us, yeah, poor air quality. This is the field that every Sunday I come and play Ultimate Frisbee with a bunch of friends and co workers. And um, so I'm feeling the soreness today. So as the day ebbs on and it's a little bit after two, I'm going to make sure some prayer and I'm going to go back at it, you know, and do some grading and planning work and other admin tasks. And I'm, I'm just thankful for doing things like this. Seeing a pile of shoes makes me think of some of our chapels this last year. We had to uh, meet indoors for our school assembly in chapel because of the air quality. Um, this impacted us at home as well. Um, we tried to protect ourselves from the hazardous air um, quality by putting um, some saran wrap on our windows. Um, at times we do enjoy pizza, but also at times we are uh, cheap people who think of um, quick ways to keep ourselves healthy. We're thankful that um, People are doing more planting than they are burning these days in their fields, and um, we are also getting quite a bit of rain, so it's making it much much safer for us to go out and enjoy coffee shops, and um, so we rejoice for that. But um, hopefully, this gives you an idea of, of what it's like to live in a waffle home, where we enjoy great things, and at times we deal with um, double-sided tape on the window. You gotta laugh, guys. You gotta laugh. When we can, we go to coffee shops and watch the rain. And driving at night is quite the experience. You can ask Queenie, she's a trusting woman. Please pray for us to have wisdom as we spend her summer out of school and away from the family. Please pray for us as we look to the future of, for our financial needs. We are now a couple with Patreon and so are trusting in God for provision. Reach out if you want to know more about helping us stay here and here. New classes of students, kindergarten and sixth grade, are coming to us, as well as new opportunities to invest in missionary families and students for mentorship. Pray for kingdom-centered relationships. And ask that God might deepen our love for Him and each other as we grow in our marriage and let it shine for His glory. We are normal people who spend lunch with people and, uh, yeah, just being with the inner friends. And here's Queenie with her kindergartners.
cut our shadow during doing science. Here's our prayer card. We're so thankful for you and hope that you can use this to get more updates. Please um, share this video with someone else who might pray deeply for us and continue to join God as he's working with you. Thank you.